Hello guys, what's up? Hersh here from Android Solutions. So guys, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can install the uh, hexagonal ROM in your uh, Redmi Note 3, that is Snapdragon 650 uh, with Snapdragon 650 processor. So guys, first of all, let us quickly jump into the settings. And guys, you can see the MIUI version is 7.3.7 .7 with the hexa-core 1.8 GHz uh, CPU processor and RAM is 3 GB. And guys, on this MIUI stock ROM, I am going to flash the hexagonal ROM. And guys, seriously, this ROM is very cool and with having a awesome wallpapers and themes. And guys, if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader of this Redmi Note 3, and uh, uh, because most of uh, you have the same question that our bootloader has stuck on the 50%, while uh, Unlocking the bootloader, you get that message that uh, couldn't verify the device, etc. So, guys, I have made a particular video on unlocking the bootloader, and especially for those whose uh, MI unlock flash tool stuck at 50% with error, uh, couldn't verify the device. You can find the link in the description box below. So, if you guys have any problem in unlocking the bootloader, you can check out that uh, tutorial, and if you also if you face the same problem after the tutorial or the same process you can message me so guys let's get started first of all guys we have to jump into the settings oh uh, sorry into a twrp recovery power of the device now you have to press this volume up key and power uh, power key two of them together until you see the miui logo Now press uh, release the buttons. Guys, make sure that my TWRP version is 3.0.2 2. So make sure to have the same version. And guys, please first of all make the backup of your device. Select the storage where you want to make the backup. And swipe for the better uh, backup as I have already made the backup. So I will not remade the backup. And now guys first of all click on this wipe button, select advanced wipe and select the first wipe option. Make sure not to select this micro SD card because the main ROM files are in the micro SD card. Now guys swipe for the factory backup or uh, factory reset. It's over. Now guys we have to install the ROM. First of all click on this install button and locate your ROM. I have placed my ROM in my external SD card. And here you can see here is my room. You will find the desired links in the description box below. So guys, no need to take tension. You can uh, just find them in the description box links. Make sure to download them properly and place them in your external SD card. Click on it and now swipe to confirm flash. You can see the hexagonal will. Guys, I have also made a WhatsApp group on this and uh, named as Android Solutions. And if you guys wanted to be added in, in that group, uh, you can click on the link which will be given in the description box below. That is the direct invite link. Make sure to open that link in your phone and then open it in your WhatsApp and you will be directly added in that group. And if you guys face any problem, you can message me. Now guys, click on this reboot system. You can see the MI logo. Now that MI logo has been uh, changed to this Android one, it will take up Simon booting up. Guys, I have also have a one FB page. If you want to, uh, if you want to get the quick replies, you can message me on my F Facebook page. Or if you guys want me to make a, a video or tutorials on any particular topic on this Redmi Note 3 or Samsung Galaxy S2 you can comment down in the comment box below i will definitely try my best to make the uh, tutorials on that topic guys it will take up some time in booting up 
सो जस्ट सिट बैक एंड रिलैक्स एंड लेट इट बूट अप ऑटोमेटिकली आई हैव ऑल्सो मेड सेवरल वीडियोज एंड टूटोरियल्स ऑन दिस रेडमी नोट थ्री एंड यू कैन फाइल द लिंक्स इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स बिलो मेक श्योर टू चेक दैम ऑल आउट आई हैव मेड द हाउ टू इंस्टॉल दिस एनोजन मोड थर्टीन विथ फिंगर प्रिंट सपोर्ट इन दिस रेडमी नोट थ्री uh and also the aosp rom which is pre rooted and pre gapped so as you can see that it's now installing some applications and this is written in some spanish language i don't know which language most prob probably spanish don't worry this rom will install in the english language and according to me this rom is also pre rooted so as you don't need to root this rom again that's a plus point on on this rom and mainly about the ram management this rom have a very good ram management with uh, actually i have tried this rom with uh, several apps and i have opened uh, eight to 10 apps and do some multitasking but then also i get a decent ram free or available around 800 to 900 900 ram in my 3 gigs variant so that's a plus point uh, so guys this installation will be and of this installation or optimizing the apps will be over soon and this rom contains actually this rom is a combination of actually 3 to 4 rooms that is omni rom slim rom and many others so guys let let us get started select the language english united states now if you want to select the wifi network you can or just you can skip it skip it so this rom is also supported fingerprint you can add this screen lock next Next. Now you can add your fingerprint. You can select which not begins you want to show after you set fingerprint. Now gently. Oh, uh, skip. Sorry. Place your fingerprint on it. Till this circle completely fills this with this blue one. now click on next next click on it to improve your battery life next you can adjust your time zone from here you can find this kolkata here you can select the current date desired date i mean click on next now start it will find the apps on sony applications so guys this is our aosp rom and on clicking it you can find this applications you can find it has a camera pretty decent camera you can find tons of options here and also it has dolby atoms it's a sound module if you enable it you can get a better sound quality and you have pre installed screen recorder so no need to install screen recorder again and again and it has many themes you can find this brightness bar here and if you want to add the wifi you can add it here it is connected guys now quickly jump up into the settings click on about phone you can find this external room forum save by clicking on clicking on it you can see device model is redmi note 3 but android version is that is marshmallow pretty decent 
so guys let let us jump now into the customization part and if you want to customize your device you can jump uh, go into the status bar and select the clock style and date format etc and in general you can find the status bar icons battery status style or quick pull down menu brightness control and here you can see your battery life the graph chart of the battery and you can also enable the battery saver mode if you want to enable it and in security part you can make your encryption and other options and in this memory part uh, you can uh, find out the uh, storage mainly basically storage you can find out here and as i said that this rom is pre-installed with the super su here you can find the super su app so no need to install uh, or flash the super su because this room uh, rom has already granted the super permission uh, for the root and here you can download a desired theme if you don't like this theme stock theme you can download it simply uh, from the play store as this will open the play store accordingly as i think so guys you can check it out yourself so guys that's all in this video if you like my video please subscribe to my channel and like the videos if it work well for you so guys see you in my next video